stuff, what's up? We have pulled up to Target, and truthfully, I've already been in Target. <laughs> I was just gonna do a vlog, but I was wandering through the clothing, and there were so many cute things, and I was like, you know what? I really am gonna do the try-on. Uh, I wasn't, I was gonna do a try-on, then I wasn't gonna do a try-on, then I was gonna do a try-on, because my tummy's off. I don't know what's going on. I think, I honestly think there's something in certain flavored vegan milks that does not agree with me, uh, because I... <laughs> I tell me he's doing the same thing it did when I tried like the maple oat beverage uh, from Trader Joe's and this morning I don't know why I decided I needed to try the good and gather oat milk eggnog because it was in my fridge <laughs> I had been so excited to try an oat milk eggnog uh, in my coffee and uh, as soon as I finished my coffee I think that's what it is uh, my tummy's just a little off that mixed with a very sensitive tummy from all of the recent stress sorry to tell you my life story at the beginning of this but I want you to know why uh, I kind of look slightly like a drowned rat because I've been in and out and it's like freezing rain or something right now uh, bleh. so that is why so anyway uh normally i'm like we're gonna go to target but um truthfully i already went to target but here's your intro so it is christmas eve and i need to make those cinnamon rolls if you saw my last uh my q a video i talked about it how every christmas i make cinnamon rolls so i need needed a few more things just to make sure i didn't run out of anything and i needed some sliced almonds because usually i put almonds in some of them uh so yeah i came to target to grab those things and then i wasn't sure if i was gonna grab any extra gifts i decided to behave because honestly i got everyone more gifts than i meant to because that happens every year almost uh but yeah so i just wanted to kind of see what was up and I walked through the clothes and it's so funny because the last time I was here I walked by and they had all different colored sparkly sweaters in the plus size section and I was like I have to come back but everything happened with the queen so I haven't been back um, to do a try on at Target in like I don't know how long now so <laughs> you'll see they had one left one left so I tried that one on as you'll see in the video yeah I don't think like this is gonna be the longest video because my tummy's a little off just stressy and I really think whatever the eggnog for some reason didn't agree with me just like the maple oat beverage didn't agree with me uh, I don't know what's going on with my tummy there must be something in there I'll have to compare some weird ingredient like I normally don't have really food allergies besides like obviously if I eat meat or dairy I'm gonna get sick because I haven't in years but anything else is usually fine so usually a vegan product is fine but I feel like I had a little bit of dairy milk is what my tummy feels like anyway a long story long it isn't that long <laughs> That is why. Uh, but I hope you guys had a wonderful holiday if you choose to celebrate Christmas. Let's go ahead and get into the Target shop with me slash try on. I didn't shop around for a long time because I really just kind of went straight to the plus size section to see what they had. Um, but yeah, let's see. Let's go to Target, guys. Let's go. All right, babes, let's go to Target. So I started in the junior section. I thought this was super cute. I always look at the junior section, even though I am plus size, because sometimes an XXL works. And also, a lot of these items, like Wild Fable and stuff like that, will come in plus sizes online. So you can always look in the store, and if you like it, you can check online. Um, I think you can even scan the tag, maybe? I don't know. I know at Walmart you can do that. I hope you can do that at Target. I'm pretty sure you can and that'll tell you just like usually if you just scan the exact same thing it'll show down by the size that it comes in plus size as well by the way the bean got me a new mic for voiceovers for christmas uh, i don't have the patience tonight because it's literally christmas and i am a sleepy sleepy bean to try and figure it out and all that jazz and i might need a special cord for it so i am going to do that at another time very soon but hopefully by the time we have an, another voiceover, we will have a much nicer mic because I know just using my laptop the way it is isn't that great. But anyway, I picked up the accessories, accessories, if I can speak. I love Target accessories. I just got the cutest beanie there. I should have showed you, but I'll show you soon in a vlog or something. Uh, lots of fun stuff, cute sparkly purses. I thought this little silk top was cute, but I did not grab it to try on. Again, a lot of times an XXL will work for me, but I do prefer plus sizes. And sometimes I'll go in the store and try on the XXL and then get a good idea and then order the plus size online. Um, so I, the thing I wanted to try on the most was one of these sparkly sweaters. And I do think it was pretty cool that the only one left was a 2X in the black, because that's what I would have probably gone for. Uh, and I thought those little tops were really cute. The slip ones, I grabbed one to try on. I kind of wish I would have tried on that coat I just showed you. I did grab this cardigan to try on. They had lots of fun stuff. Um, I was trying to get, 
I was trying to do something different. I was like, can you see me if I put you here? And they had some really cute sets. It came in two different colors in store. Uh, it might come in more online. Oh my goodness, the tiny queen is tired and she just huffed and puffed at me like, mom, you just recorded this voiceover. Why are you doing it again? There are, there are reasons why her name is the tiny queen. I mean, really her name is Anastasia, Anna, but she's the tiny queen. I love you. I'm almost done. I promise. <laughs> And then I did think those jackets were really cute. I didn't grab them because they didn't have the black one in my size and I didn't feel like the white one was 100% my jam. I did go over to the Knox Rose stuff because they always have really cute stuff and again a lot of that is in plus sizes online and I thought this top was really pretty. Anything sparkly always catches my eye so I grabbed the XXL to try on which you will see. They had so many cute cardigans not only in the Knox Rose line but all throughout Target if you're looking for a sweater or a cardigan Target is the place to be right now I can't remember if this is the exact same leopard cardigan I tried on last time which I feel like is wild because I feel like Target doesn't keep things for that long but now I'm second-guessing I'm bad I need to like check my past videos before I try on anything I swear I <laughs> do a try on here's my outfit of the day my coat is from Fashion Nova my jeans are from Fashion Nova and my flats are from Amazon and the sweatshirt you'll see at the end is from Shein in case I forget. So here's a sparkly sweater. I almost wish that they would have had more sizes to try on. But in a way, I'm going to tell you right now. I checked when I got home. This sweater is on sale online for like $10 cheaper. And hopefully it's still on sale as of last night on Christmas Eve. It was only $15 and it comes in four colors. And from what I could tell, literally every size was left in like all of them. And I think they're really cute and they're actually really soft even though they have like that kind of tinsely material in there. I feel like sometimes those sweaters are itchy. I didn't find that one to be itchy, but I thought that was a total win. Very soft and comfy. I probably would order either a 3X or a 4X because you guys know I love comfy, comfy. The 2X is great and like is my size, but you know what I'm saying. I love a comfy, comfy. Uh, these two, total win. These two might have been like my favorite things that I tried on, which totally surprised me. I love this cardigan so much more than I even thought I would. Anything that looks kind of like a checkered or a geometric situation, I am so into right now. And this little top, I feel like it just hangs so beautifully. I'm wearing just a regular bra, not like my fancy push-up, push-up bra. Just like a reg my regular Amazon bra. If you've been in off room, you know exactly which one that is. I really like it, um, but it's just a very basic bra. And I felt like this top still looked really nice even with that. And the sweater was so comfy and soft. I thought I would give you a shot of the top without the sweater on so you could get a really good idea because I thought it was absolutely beautiful and honestly pretty nicely priced. I think it would be beautiful tucked into some really nice like slacks if you could totally wear it to work I think. Well depending on your dress code. I did want to show you that it does have adjustable straps so just everything about that tucked into a skirt would be cute. So many options. Next is the sparkly top from Knox Rose. What I love about this is I feel like often if you have a belly as I do tops like this will make you look a little bit pregnant no offense to anyone that's pregnant but you know nobody wants to be asked if they're pregnant when they're not pregnant uh it's just not good for anybody <laughs> so I love that this one hangs in a really nice way where I don't feel that way because that's very often that I feel like I do especially in the last few years as my belly seems to have gotten bigger <laughs> I feel like any weight I've gained has been like in the belly uh, but yeah, it's really beautiful. I really like it. And I think I like it even more now. I feel like a lot of things, for example, this top, I felt like did make me look pregnant when I was trying it on. But I think that a lot of it was just psychological because my tummy felt so bloated. And I was bloated because, again, I really think that that oat milk eggnog, something in certain flavored non-dairy milks, <laughs> just apparently my body does not agree with them. The plain oat milk from Trader Joe's, the, any of the flavored oat milks, and apparently I'm just going to not do it again because I was not feeling good and it definitely happened in the exact same way so I'm now positive that that's what it was. So I apologize that I had to film on a day where my tummy didn't feel great but I'm just letting you know it affected how I felt about the clothing because of course if you feel bloated you're going to feel weird about your belly. Maybe not everyone but definitely me. But long story long, <laughs> for the million time, I love this sweater. They only had it in a 4X, but again, you know me. Even though technically my size is a 2X and 8 Viv, I loved this. I loved this. 
so much. And when it comes to like dresses in Avon Viv, I can often even do a 1x. But you'll see, I, fl I showed a, a flash of like a romper. I thought it was a dress. They didn't have a 2x, so I grabbed the 1x. And I normally would go up in a romper, but I can go down in a dress, if that makes sense. So red sweater, absolutely beautiful, super comfy, super soft, 10 out of 10. Love it, love it, love it. I need to check online because it looked like they had more sweaters on sale online. I'm just rambling, so I'm running a minute behind. I'm sorry, guys. Here's that two-piece set. I grabbed the top and the 2X, which I think is the perfect size, and the pants in a 3X, and they're so stretchy and so comfy that I feel like I could have easily done the 2X. So you easily could do your true size or maybe even go down a size in these pants. I feel like they were so generously sized, but I did like how these fit. And I'm surprised for them being kind of a boot cut, how much I liked them. I loved boot cut when I was younger, but I've just become such a skinny jean girl or a wide leg jean girl that normally, I don't know, I just feel like flares and boot cuts often look kind of weird on me. But I feel like these didn't make my legs look stumpy. I don't know, sometimes my legs just look weird because my torso is so long. And I feel like they make my legs look weird, but I love these pants incredibly comfy and I feel like you can you could wear them at home as lounge pants or totally dress them up and mix and match those both the top and the pants sorry I'm very excited about it <laughs> and then here is the cardigan which I may have already tried on before but I don't remember it's gorgeous you guys just know if I see a leopard cardigan or a leopard sweater your girl's gonna try it on because I am a leopard lover for life and I loved that it had pockets it was a great length Everything about it was awesome. So the next item I tried on was this green dress. I did try the romper for a moment and I just didn't feel like it was going to work. So I just scrapped it because again, my tummy hurt and I didn't want to put anything tight on. So I just was like, never mind. But I think it's going to be really cute. I just would probably need a 2X for sure, not a 1X. But anyway, let's talk about this guy. Again, I felt a little uncomfy at the time because again, I felt bloated. It's so funny how... I'm looking at it so much different now, and I think it's a really beautiful dress. I believe it also came in black. I just wanted to give you guys something a little bit different because, of course, I wanted the black one. But I have more black slip dresses than anyone needs. But anyway, let's go to the car and talk about it. All right, loves. Hello, it's me. Two seconds later, but um, we'll pretend that this is after. Well, it is after. Now I can actually film the after, and it's actually after instead of pretending that it's before. Okay. <laughs> So lots of cute things. I love the Ava and Viv line at Target. Uh, they don't always have a large selection, which stinks. Of course, they have so many more cute things online. And honestly, I really do need to do a like mail order Target try on soon because most of the stuff I see is so cute from on the website. And like all of the Wild Fable stuff and stuff like that comes in plus sizes online, but not in store, which is a bummer. Uh, my favorite was probably the sparkly sweater that you saw. I did end up just getting the food items that I needed because as you guys know, I do not need a single piece of clothing. But if I go, if I do these try-ons and I find something I can't live without, of course I'll get it. But generally, I really don't need clothing. I do these for you guys uh, to, you know, see what's up. Maybe you need a, a last minute holiday item I don't know a last minute holiday dress uh that green dress was so cute I wish I had grabbed the 4x in the romper I didn't realize it was a romper I thought it was a dress and so I grabbed the 1x because normally a 1x fine but I was struggling to get over my booty and again like I said I didn't feel that great so I decided to just scrap that one but try it on everything else lots of fun sweaters they have so many cute things sweater wise right now and cardigans oh my goodness you need a cardigan Target is the place to go. I really liked that leopard cardigan. So cute. But yeah, I honestly liked every single thing I tried on. Just none of them were anything that like I couldn't live without. You know what I'm saying? Um, but yeah, fun times at Target. Definitely go check it out if you want to. It wasn't too busy today. I tried to go a little slightly later in the day because I know if I go in the morning on Christmas Eve, I just remember working in retail in the morning would be insane. And then after it hit like 2 p.m., like no one was there. But that was also the mall. This is Target. Everyone's always at Target. Uh, but yeah, that's what's up. I think I'm gonna go home now, um, and make these cinnamon rolls and edit this video and hang out with my cats because that's my favorite thing to do. The tiny queen is doing really well. Knock on wood. Uh, thank you again for all of your well wishes for her. Uh, the last couple days have been really great and she's even no longer on her like anti-inflammatory medication. So the fact that she feels good when she's not on that is like a miracle. But anyway, 
I love you guys so much. Please give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. Share it if you could. And if you made it to the end, leave the little target emoji. You know which one I'm talking about. Um, yeah, and I think that's it. Love you guys. I hope you had a wonderful holiday if you choose to celebrate. I hope it was wonderful. And I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for watching. I will talk to you soon. Bye. Errands. I ended up just getting food. Um, well, I should tell you that at the end. I come and do these guys for you. Do these guys? What? <laughs>